I love 70 millimeter, especially when it's kind of an event. We'll see the 70 millimeters just for the scope of how it was filmed. There's films that they have not seen, even though they may have seen it, until they see it in 70 millimeter on the big screen. 70 millimeter is a large gauge film format. It's a specialty format. 70 millimeter became popular in like the 1960s. This is a, a modern 70 millimeter print. It's actually a trailer for the movie Dunkirk. I think it's a little over two and a half times the size of 35 millimeter. When we talk about the differences between film and digital are resolution and also dynamic range, which is a big part of resolution. It's like the measurement between the blackest blacks and the whitest whites. You can actually say that like 35 millimeter film is the equivalent of 4.5K and 70 millimeter, it's like 10K. Some people point to the organic nature of the grain structure actually does something different to your eyes. The projectors have, have not quite caught up. I'm really proud that we're still showing stuff on film because the digital takeover is complete, but it's not necessarily better. That's why the filmmakers are like, we want to make some 70 millimeter prints because they want to see how they shot it. Paul Thomas Anderson talked about when you see the master projected digitally, it looks like Joaquin Phoenix is wearing a blue shirt and brown pants. And then when you see it in 70 millimeter print, he's wearing a denim shirt and corduroy pants. It's like this information is revealed to you. You have to have relationships with archives to get a lot of these prints. They are like irreplaceable. You know, we get a movie like Lawrence of Arabia and it's like 11 of these cans. These projectors are dual format. There's a bunch of parts that need to be pulled out and replaced with the 70 millimeter parts. So we pull this whole piece out and we replace it with this one. Spindles have to be replaced. And this is a much larger diameter. You have to make sure stuff is all up and, you know, ready to go when you're gonna do a 70 show. It's a really exciting format. You know, I think of it sometimes as like, you could just got your glasses cleaned. It's just stunning to look at. It's like going to see an orchestra or going to see the opera or, or something. It's just like very memorable um, experience that doesn't happen very often.